Ever get lost in a new city? Frustrating, right? Introductions are like maps for your writing. They guide readers, showing them what to expect and why they should care. Without a good introduction, your brilliant ideas might get lost. Think about your favorite books or articles. What grabbed you from the start? Chances are the author hooked you with a compelling question, a surprising fact, or a relatable anecdote. They made you curious. They made you want to keep reading. But introductions aren't just for entire pieces of writing. Each section needs its own mini introduction. Why? Because readers need those guideposts along the way. They need to know what each section is about and how it connects to the bigger picture. So how do you write introductions that grab readers and don't let go? That's what we're going to explore in this essay. Get ready to master the art of the opener. Each section of your writing is like a new scene in a movie. Just as a director meticulously plans each scene to ensure the story flows seamlessly, you too must carefully craft each section of your writing to maintain coherence and engagement. Imagine a movie suddenly jumping to a different location and time without any context. Confusing, right? This abrupt shift can leave the audience disoriented and disconnected from the narrative. That's what it's like for a reader when a new section appears out of the blue. They lose track of the argument or story, and their engagement plummets. A strong section introduction provides that crucial context. It acts as a bridge, guiding the reader smoothly from one idea to the next. It tells readers where they are in the story or argument. Think of it as a map that highlights the route, ensuring the reader knows exactly where they are headed. It reminds them of the main point and sets the stage for what's to come. This preparation is essential for maintaining the reader's interest and ensuring they grasp the significance of the upcoming content. But how do you make these section introductions engaging? How do you capture the reader's attention right from the start? One effective technique is to start with a question. Questions naturally pique curiosity and invite the reader to think. For example, if you're writing about different types of essay introductions, you might ask. Ever wonder why some essays grab you from the first sentence while others fall flat? This question immediately engages the reader by addressing a common experience. See what we did there? By posing a relatable question, we created a connection with the reader and set the stage for the discussion. We posed a relatable question that directly connects to the topic of this section. This technique not only engages the reader, but also provides a clear direction for the content that follows. Now we need to answer it. Providing a thoughtful and thorough answer reinforces the reader's trust and keeps them invested in your writing. The answer, of course, lies in the importance of crafting compelling introductions that pique the reader's interest and set the tone for the entire piece. A well-crafted introduction can make all the difference in how your writing is received. Before we move on to the next section, which delves into the art of asking effective questions, Take a moment to think about your own experiences with section introductions. Reflect on what has worked for you and what hasn't. What makes a section introduction stand out to you? Is it a thought-provoking question, a surprising fact, or a compelling anecdote? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Your insights could help others improve their writing and create more engaging content. Questions are powerful tools in writing. They have the unique ability to transform a piece of text from a monologue into a dialogue. They transform passive readers into active participants, making them feel like they are part of a conversation rather than just absorbing information. When you ask a question, you invite readers to pause, reflect and come up with their own answers. This engagement is crucial for maintaining their interest and making the content more memorable. This makes them feel more involved in the reading process, as if they are contributing to the narrative themselves. But not all questions are created equal. Some questions can fall flat and fail to engage the reader. To truly engage your readers, you need to ask the right questions. These questions should be carefully crafted to provoke thought and curiosity. They should be relevant to the topic at hand and encourage the reader to think more deeply about the subject. 
These are questions that are relevant to the topic, thought-provoking and maybe even a little bit surprising. They should challenge the reader's assumptions and prompt them to consider new perspectives. Let's say you're writing about the benefits of exercise. You could ask a simple question like, what is exercise? But that might not capture the reader's interest. A rather dull question might be, what is exercise? This question is too basic and doesn't invite deeper thinking. A more engaging question could be, what if you could improve your mood, boost your energy, and even live longer, all by doing one simple thing? This question is intriguing and hints at the benefits of exercise. Do you see the difference? The second question sparks curiosity and makes the reader want to learn more. The second question sparks curiosity and hints at the benefits discussed in the section. It makes the reader want to learn more and keeps them engaged. It makes the reader want to learn more. They become eager to find out the answer and understand the benefits of the topic being discussed. And the answer, of course, is regular exercise. By framing the question in an engaging way, you make the reader more invested in the content. Asking the right questions is like having a conversation with your reader. It creates a dynamic interaction where the reader feels involved and valued. You pose a question, provide the answer, and then invite them to share their own thoughts and experiences. This back and forth keeps the reader engaged and makes the content more interactive. Speaking of which, we'd love to hear from you. Your insights and experiences can add valuable perspectives to the discussion. What are some of your favorite ways to engage readers with questions in your own writing? How do you craft questions that spark curiosity and encourage deeper thinking? Share your insights in the comments. Your feedback can help others improve their writing and create more engaging content. Calls to action and surveys, keeping readers involved. You've crafted engaging introductions, asked thought-provoking questions, and now it's time to take reader engagement to the next level. How? By incorporating calls to action and surveys. These tools are essential in transforming your content from a one-way communication channel into a dynamic, interactive experience. Think about your favorite websites or blogs. Do they simply present information or do they encourage you to take action? The most engaging platforms don't just inform, they invite you to participate. Maybe they have comment sections, social media sharing buttons, or even quizzes and polls. These features are designed to make you feel like a part of the conversation rather than just a passive observer. These are all examples of calls to action. They prompt you to engage, to share your thoughts, and to contribute to the community. But why are calls to action so important? They serve as bridges between the content creator and the audience, because they transform passive readers into active participants. This transformation is crucial for building a loyal and engaged audience. They give readers a way to engage with your content on a deeper level, this deeper engagement can lead to more meaningful interactions and a stronger connection with your audience. Instead of just consuming information, they can share their thoughts, contribute to the conversation, and feel like they are part of something bigger and become part of a community. This sense of community can be incredibly powerful, fostering loyalty and encouraging repeat visits. Let's say you're writing about different writing techniques. You could ask your readers, What's your go-to writing tip that helps you overcome writer's block? This question not only invites engagement, but also provides valuable insights that can benefit the entire community. This simple question encourages readers to share their own experiences and learn from one another. It turns your blog into a collaborative space where everyone can contribute and benefit. Surveys are another powerful tool for engaging readers. They offer a structured way to gather feedback and understand your audience's preferences. They allow you to gather valuable feedback, understand your audience better, and even tailor your content to their interests. This tailored content can significantly increase reader satisfaction and engagement. 
For example, you could create a short survey asking readers what topics they'd like to see covered in future blog posts. This not only shows that you value their input, but also helps you create content that resonates with your audience. For example, you could create a short survey asking readers what topics they'd like to see covered in future blog posts. This not only shows that you value their input, but also helps you create content that resonates with your audience. We're curious to know how you prefer to interact with online content. Your preferences can guide us in creating more engaging and interactive experiences. Do you enjoy leaving comments, participating in surveys, or sharing articles on social media? Each of these actions helps build a more vibrant and interactive community or sharing articles on social media. Sharing content not only spreads valuable information, but also brings more people into the conversation. Let us know by taking our quick poll below. Your participation is crucial in helping us understand what works best for you. Your feedback will help us create even more engaging and interactive content in the future. We appreciate your input and look forward to making our content even better with your help. Conclusion, your journey to writing mastery. As we've explored in this essay, mastering the art of writing involves paying attention to every detail, from the overall structure down to the individual sentences. Engaging introductions, both for the entire piece and for each section, are crucial for capturing the reader's attention and guiding them through your ideas. Asking effective questions is another powerful technique for keeping readers engaged. By posing thought-provoking questions, you invite readers to actively participate in the reading process and make connections with the material. And finally, incorporating calls to action and surveys takes reader engagement to a whole new level. These interactive elements transform passive readers into active participants, fostering a sense of community and providing valuable feedback. So as you embark on your writing journey, remember that every word, every sentence, every paragraph is an opportunity to connect with your reader. Craft your introductions with care. Ask questions that spark curiosity and don't be afraid to invite your readers to join the conversation. Now, we'd love to hear from you. What is one key takeaway you'll be implementing in your own writing? Share your thoughts in the comments below or participate in our